I'm Sergeant Stephen Hondras with the Broward County Sheriff's Office Gang Investigations Unit. So today we concluded a multi-year investigation into the Allwoods Gang. This uh, particular gang uh, had been involved in the distribution of large quantities of very dangerous narcotics. Uh, they were pushing out large quantities of fentanyl and heroin out onto the street. And additionally, they were involved in um, violent crimes, shootings, um, plenty of them. So, uh, you know, with taking them off the street, this community is absolutely a safer place to be. So recently we secured arrest warrants for 24 members of the gang uh, for charges relating to racketeering violations and conspiracy to commit racketeering, um, some, of which, uh, some of which the subjects were already in police custody. Um, and so today we went out and we began systematically and methodically picking up everyone. In addition to the racketeering uh, violations, uh, three of them were being charged with a conspiracy to commit a murder of a uh, gang member, uh, another gang in the neighborhood. Um, originally we had um, began investigating this gang in 2017 due to an uptick in uh, violence and narcotics and fentanyl sales on the street. Uh, we had an uptick of overdoses and uh, you know, our community was crying out to us. So we began an uh, uh, investigation into this uh, identified street level gang that was terrorizing the neighborhood. So during the course of this investigation, we seized uh, large quantities of narcotics to include cocaine, heroin, fentanyl, uh, we're talking about upwards of 20 to 40 kilos of each. Um, we've also seized over a million dollars in jewelry, uh, large amounts of currency, uh, around 800,000. We've also seized um, over 70 firearms during the course of this investigation from this, from this group. So this particular investigation was a, a coordinated effort amongst uh, all stakeholders that, are in, that we have in our law enforcement community. We've uh, included not just the local partners, to, such as the statewide prosecutor's office, but we included our federal, federal partners in this investigation, our partners such as the DEA, the ATF, and HSI. Uh, 